the sole suspect in the shooting of the son and husband of New Jersey federal judge Esther Salas, was found dead from an apparent self-inflicted gunshot wound on Monday, according to media reports. The suspect, identified as Roy Den Hollander, was a self-described anti-feminist lawyer who had a case before Salas in 2015, court records show. He was reportedly found in his car in Sullivan County, New York, about two hours north of New York City. Investigators have preliminary information that someone dressed as a FedEx driver arrived at the family home at about 5 p.m. on Sunday, ABC News reported. Salas' husband was shot as he opened the door to the gunman, who then shot and killed her son. Judge Salas was home at the time of the shooting, but was in the basement and was not injured, according to media reports and a friend of the family. New Jersey Governor Phil Murphy on Monday called the shooting a, quote, horrific crime. I want to start today by offering my prayers, and I know my colleagues join me, to federal court judge Esther Salas, whose son was murdered and husband seriously wounded yesterday in a brazen and cowardly act of gun violence at their home in North Brunswick. This is an unconscionable tragedy. The motive behind the killing remains unclear.